Let's go with this one. Top 10 unusual vehicles, cars, or airplanes. Yeah, let's just see what, what's, what's 10 unusual cars or anything. Let's what's go. the most unusual thing you've ridden? Mine is Simon's mum. Yeah, I uh, knew that. I anyway, he said the word ridden. <laughs> Why? Right, Josh is here. Mom. Josh is here. His mum, though. Like, in what, what, can, you, can you what? It doesn't matter because we're looking at the ten most unusual vehicles. I'm here with Simon and Josh. <laughs> Let's do Why? it. Three years ago. Ten most unusual vehicles. Oh. I'm here with Simon and Josh. <laughs> Let's Why, do it. Why, man? <laughs> every, every time. <laughs> New Year, New Year. Oh, oh, the animal. This time, a vehicle. Oh. Hi there. Today, we present to you the 10 most unusual vehicles created by both professionals and self-taught investors. You know what? I'm just happy there's no images of my mum that they can like edit in <laughs> The Manta 5 hydrofoil bike, which was released by bicycle designer Robert Ooh. Manta, is a water analog electric that bike. That does not look good. It looks very good. It doesn't look very good. underwater wings and electric assistant torsion okay. pedals. So now it's going. Manto 5 has an aluminum frame underneath which are two Jacob, submarine maybe just getting wings. started is they lift like, the bicycle difficult. over the water when yeah. it is moving the wow. bicycle is powered by a person and an auxiliary electric motor with I mean, a capacity even still, of 400 not, watts it. Really? it has special modules oh, that are responsible for the balance of the bike and holding the bicycle on the water during a stop it's a bit long the though, bike has a mass Actually. of 20 kilograms but is capable of withstanding a rider weighing up to 100 kilograms 20 kg bike, when used yeah, at maximum off. power a, the battery lasts for though. one hour yeah, while the true, bike can true. accelerate to 20 kilometers per hour oh wow just get a jet ski the company arca space <gasps> it's not a lego block is it presented its original look as a concept of a hoverboard it's a lego block it is able to hover above the ground by 36 small fans controlled by high-speed motors. That is quite cool. The manufacturer states that the power of this device is 272 horsepower. Oh. Arca board is more powerful Why than most cars. Why does this look like a Zach King video, though? The dimensions of the device are about one meter long and half Dang. a meter wide. In general, this thing is very cumbersome and was very poorly thought out. You can only stand on it while trying your best <laughs> not to fall down. But also, like, where are you putting that? So you go out for the day, where are you putting it? <laughs> You'll see, he parked it between two no Lambos. designer and kiteboarder Don Montague, These are cool. together yeah, with his team cool. Kai Concepts, I, I tried to it. connect a motorized Once. surfboard I mean, yeah, and hydrofoil. The result was a device that the creators called Jetfoiler. A Maybe not, you know the one that you have to push down on. The board, yeah. And then the board. Yeah, yeah, that thing. Yeah, enter, I tried that one. Which allows yeah, the rider to literally yeah, this one's fly <laughs> over the surface I realized, I was like, of water. <laughs> Definitely not this Surfing one. <laughs> this way is very simple, and everyone can handle Hello, it. Hello, buddy. You control the speed of your board with a remote control. The creator explains that as soon as the board is gaining sufficient speed, the rider leans back and the board rises from the water. It's quite cool. This one's the coolest the so far. A young team from Switzerland oh. has developed an electric <laughs> stair climbing <laughs> wheelchair, Siwu, which is capable already, of climbing the stairs. Oh, and don't, and don't do it to oh, them. No. It two mechanisms don't with do it to caterpillar them. Tracks. Oh. In normal situations, no, okay. the rider uses yeah, wallet, only the wheels and the tracks are under the hull. Okay, but when it is necessary, that is they cool. take on the user's movement and are able to lift the chair along the stairs. And All right, it yeah. is easy to move around on the ice or gravel. Love it. In addition, the chair itself rises higher. The compact size allows you to adjust the seat to pass through any door and easily maneuver in the room. Say less. The user can control the chair either by using a joystick or by transferring body <laughs> weight. What was that this is a very that was such a weird shot. <laughs> Why was he smiling at someone and they're not even looking at him? <laughs> Why is that so committed? He's just staring at us. It's what is so this funny. Voice? Either by using a joystick. He looks like he needs a poo. Oh, come red. It's helped me. Really red. Solo Will Iota. I hate seen these. A hybrid of the usual gyroscope with a mono wheel. If you ride these around in the street, you're a neek. Some yeah. moms do this in London still. No, they do. I've seen them. The project was launched on Kickstarter. The price of the device starts at $445. The first buyers receive their orders in late 2017. You can tell by the shoes that all of them are wearing. The device can reach speeds of up to 16 <laughs> kilometers oh, an hour. And on a crepes. full battery, 
It can go almost <laughs> well, like a what Aaron is. <laughs> It is so little in size and super lightweight that this device can be extremely useful. Wait, you in got the city. car. Just get in the car. Just get in the car. Get back in the car. It allows you to easily take it with you on a subway, thereby leaving you with a good means of transportation to the metro and back. Wow. In general, this device seems to be made especially for lazy people or for those always in a hurry. Oh. <laughs> He's having a good time. <laughs> a young Japanese engineer, Kuniako Saito, recently developed a portable <laughs> walk car. This a portable is a walk transport car. that is placed in a backpack or bag. Simply put, it is a board with four wheels on which you can go at a speed of up to 12 kilometers per hour. Right. Although walk car is light and small, nevertheless, it can withstand a rider <laughs> weighing up to 120 kilograms. And on one charge, can travel. You're fucking Iron Man in the background. What's happening? <laughs> you know what the fuck is happening? Look! What video am I watching? Can travel up to 17 <laughs> kilometers. It is the size of a laptop, but looks more like a skateboard. Walk car is made of aluminum, and it weighs two to three kilograms, depending on the nice version. light on the front as well. For home or street use, there are different happen? models. It's next. They put it next to the spokeway. Useful. Providing you with transportation oh, without oh. any effort. Oh. <laughs> I thought he was going to send it. Edward Diewill is a very original and unusual what? vehicle. That's just a, that's just Electric just vehicles that. appear today almost everywhere, but they are more or less the same. Yeah, yeah, University really. Students in Australia decided to stand out from right. the general He's... masses. I mean, it's cool to spin around in, but not to cut about. This is trying to go forward. <laughs> Me trying to drive our robot. <laughs> Quadro 4 is a four-wheeled tourist scooter. No. The manufacturer claims that it is a novelty a no thanks me. to the What's four the wheels and the unique technology of the tilting suspension, HTS, which has stability and safety in all conditions. Why not just get a bike? This is what I'm thinking. Just get a bike. The tilt system allows this novelty to bend in turns at an angle of up to 40 degrees. I'd argue this isn't that unusual, is it? It's, it's not. It's a four-wheeled bike. Like, the last yeah, one was bike. unusual. Yeah, the last one was unusual. Hyundai presented an incredibly compact <laughs> Ionic scooter. It's not unusual. It's just a scooter. And the idea is that a person will use this model to get from the parking lot to the destination. The scooter has a convenient folding design, allowing it to transform in just a few movements. It is. It's a this is for people scooter. that have got too much money. This is what it is. Lads, have you ever thought getting getting off out of your car to get to the train or whatever? Have you thought, wow, I could really do with a 600 quid scooter? Yeah. No. Oh, wow. No, you're, no me, you're, neither. me neither. Me neither. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> KSI's going to have an Ionic. KSI, love them. The car manufacturer Volkswagen is developing a two seater compact air car. Here we go. No. Called Hover Car. A hover Car. Wait, what? It's got to be fake. But... Yeah, 100%. The movement of the flying car will be carried out on special magnetic roads. The lifting into the air occurs because of the use of repulsive forces of the magnetic field. Sorry? The levitating right. vehicle That's will be fake. controlled That's... by means of a joystick. <laughs> hover car will be equipped with an automatic that. accident prevention system. Also, the concept of wireless charging of an air car while driving is being developed. Right. The project right. by That's Volkswagen just kind was about, presented in Beijing, China as a virtual model. Together with Volkswagen, Chinese partners will take part in this implementation. Wow. They haven't even like tried to make it look real. I mean, it's, that, that's unusual. There we go. Now we're hitting. <laughs> and what do you think about these vehicles? Would you like to have any of them? I like... Do you know what? I like four wheels one. on the floor. That's what I like. I don't like that. <laughs> All right, buy one of them bikes then. No. I like cars. <laughs> yeah, you feel like four wheels. I like cars. You said you like four wheels no, no, on I, the ground. I like car. Look at that. Look at the parking in this car park. Wait, what's happened? <laughs> what? I what am legend. Oh, these are the zombies. <laughs> this is zombies. Oh, they're clapping them. Well done. You got to your destination. <laughs> Surely well, well you done. turn the magnets off and it just falls. Oh. What's this one then? Why did it see this one? Yeah, why not in the video? So in my little balls. I swear hey, that's what? the house where human centipede is. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Subscribe for more. Which one are you buying? Um, Probably the... That. Yeah. That. That. Yeah, yeah I'm taking jet, that on uh, holiday jet, with jet. me. Yeah. Hoverboard on his board. Yeah. Surfboard. Surfboard. We'll all take the surfboard. Surfboard. Yeah, fuck it. Peace. Bye. Surfboard. Surfboard. Already done. Nice video. Let's go with the next one.